how do space shuttles launch? A launch occurs by combining two substances, creating a chemical reaction, resulting in an explosion. When an explosion occurs, energy is released. This energy is utilized to lift the rocket into the air. Thrust is the push of something suddenly in a specified direction. Force is continually applied by the burning fuel to gain enough force to overcome the force of gravity. These two liquids are placed in a combustion chamber where they will be create a reaction. Liquid hydrogen and liquid oxygen. The external tank contains the combustion chamber, which houses the two liquids. The solid rocket booster contains two solid substances, ammonium perchlorate and aluminum. Both the substances are in powdered form and provide the main thrust for liftoff. Only if the force applied vertically on the space shuttle is larger than the gravity will it lift off and accelerate vertically. Force equals mass times acceleration. Acceleration may be produced by applying a force to a mass such as spacecraft. If applied in the same direction as an object's velocity, the object's velocity increases. A rocket provides the means to accelerate spacecraft, like an airplane's jet engine. A rocket creates thrust by expelling mass to take advantage of Sir Isaac Newton's third law. In both systems, combustion increases the temperature of gas in the engine, causing it to expand and brush combustion off the Combustion increases velocity. the temperature of the gas in the engine, causing it to expand and rush out. Above is a model of how the, the rocket is structured. And that is how the launch of a space shuttle occurs. Thank you, and let's dominate life with Mr. Langley.